Good Tuesday evening, everybody. My name is Rick Bork. It is June the 11th, right? 11th? The airboat is home. It's gotta be, gotta be a little. So, we are out here tonight. Mother Nature is, well, she's harassing me a little bit. That's what I call it. I call it Mother Nature's harassment. Um, <laughs> it's clouding up like it's gonna rain, but we haven't seen any rain. It's rumbled like it was gonna rain and hasn't. So, I'm just kind of futzing outside. I didn't really want to get too involved in anything that was out here in case it did rain, but. Uh, I did get the grass mowed. We got the X mark out and mowed the grass. It's it's doing a good job considering I got in a tangle with a rock the other day and it kind of wiped the one blade all the wiped the corners right off that blade. So new blades will be here tomorrow. I guess we'll make a video putting those things on. I think the rest of the evening I'm gonna get this firewood out of the way. Um I'm gonna jump in the tractor and put the snow bucket on and use that to move firewood around. And uh, we'll put it over on the other side of the tractor over there. There's an old wood pile there. We'll add it to that because up here we need to clean that up so we can put the black dirt down for the grass seed. And at some point we're going to, part of that's got to get gravel dumped on it for the woodshed that's going to go there. Because by this winter I will have firewood in a shed because... That sucks, let me tell you what. Okay, I'm going to jump in the tractor and move some firewood. We're going to get that stuff cleaned up unless it starts downpouring on me. And then I'm going to go in and throw some videos together for you guys. So, I got to get to work. Okay, I got part of that move. The rain is just rolling in here now. And I'm going to head for the house before it gets here. It's just starting to come, but... You can see, just look over the barn there, and as we come around, you can see the heavy rain is just coming to the other side of the swamp. So, I'm going in. I don't need to get wet. I don't have to get wet. I don't want to get wet. So, we got that part of it cleaned up. We're going to get that split stuff out of there next. And then, uh, we'll put in a little black dirt up here on this part. And down there, we're going to dump in some, uh, some of the extra of that will be the gravel pad for that. Um, not sure how big that shed's going to be yet. Probably 24 wide. I got some 24-foot trusses that I can use for it. So I'm guessing probably 24 by 24. Somewhere in there. All right, guys. Well, we had about a five-minute gully washer there. I made it in the house just in time. I didn't get a chance to catch the cows coming from the pasture. The cow came from way out there. And beeline back around and had to zigzag through the gate and then all the way up the side here. Up in here. And they were booking it. So uh, I was trying to get that on video, but apparently I was zoomed in and not recording or fumble fingered. And I don't know what the hell happened, but I didn't get it. So anyway, they're up here now. We still got a little bit of rumble of thunder and a little bit of drizzle coming down, so... Hopefully it'll be good for the grass. We need to get some temperature to get the hay to really jump up. We're only supposed to be in the kind of 60s, maybe low 70s here for the next week. So, oh well, it is what it is. We'll get to cut hay in October, maybe. I'm going to go in and edit some videos for you guys. Hope everyone has a wonderful night, wonderful week. If you haven't watched a few more videos, please check them out. If you like these videos, throw me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, take a moment to do so. Ring my bell, get my notifications, and hey, we'll see you when the monsoon dries up. It's coming. And uh, the, the fields have slowed down a little bit, so we could use a shot of rain. So we'll see what we get. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you again next time.